Have you ever come across an error similar to the one on the screen? One place you can find such errors is when you are trying to convert an object with circular references to JSON. And maybe you have tried to do this before, maybe you haven't, but in this video, I'll be simplifying what circular references are in JavaScript object and would also use examples to make you understand why the circular reference error exists when you are trying to convert such objects to JSON. I'll be using this example here to explain circular reference in JavaScript. So here we have our obj variable and we assign it an object which has a name property, string, languages property, array, age property, number, is teacher property, boolean, channels property which is a nested object. As you know with JavaScript if we want to assess any property we call the variable we have the dot and then let's say we want to assess the name property. If I come here I run this file you can see decode coming from here. If I change this to languages you see we have this array. If I change this to um, channel if I come here, you see we have this object. Now, if I want to use json.stringify to stringify this object, let's say I have a variable called stringified, then I call json stringify, and then I pass this object. And in this console log here, I pass stringified. Now, if I come here and I run this, you can see we have the string version of this obj. Just to confirm that it is a string, I'm going to use the type of keyword, and then I pass stringified. So if I come here, I run this, you can see it is indeed a string. So this is a string version of our object. Now where does circular reference come into play? Let me comment all of this. So I'm going to come here. Now we have obj. Let's say we want to assign another property to this object. You know with object we can do that even after the object declaration. So here in obj I want to assign a new property called hello. What value do I want to assign to hello? I want to assign this object reference. So which means the hello property of obj is going to point to obj again. Now what does this this mean if I come here now and I console.log obj dot hello, clear the console here and I run this, you can see that we have the same object here. We have name, this is name, we have languages, which is languages, we have age, age is teacher, is teacher, channels, channels. But you can see again we have hello, and you can see on the console it also shows that this is circular. So let's say we have the hello here. This means we're going to have all of all these things, which I'm just going to say all of previous things, and then here we have the hello property again and the value of this property is going to still be all of previous things and then we have hello again so it keeps going and keeps going and that is where the circular reference comes in so when you hear circular reference this is what it means when a property in an object references that object so that means on obj.hello we can actually do obj.hello.hello.hello.hello and then we can assess channels so if i come here and i run this you can see we have the channels object let's say i change this to languages you see we have languages which means there is an hello property on the object which references the object which has an hello which references the object again which has an hello and you can keep going hello 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 and if you come here and run this, this would still work. So this is what a circular reference is in JavaScript. Now, why does JSON stringify throw an error when you try to stringify such object? Let me explain. I'm going to clear all of these hellos or I'm just going to comment it anyways. I'm going to comment everything here. When we call JSON stringify and we pass the obj, the JSON stringify knows it's going to stringify this. It's going to stringify this. It's going to stringify this, stringify this. When it comes here, it's going to stringify this property. Then it's going to stringify stringify this, stringify this, stringify this. Let me console log this again so we can see what it looks like. Uh, let me extend this and see if we can read it in one line or let me see if I can bring it to here. Let me see if it will make it easier to read. So I've brought this to the JavaScript file so that you can read it well. You can see in the stringify, it stringifies this name part here, it stringifies the languages part, stringifies the age part, you can see the property having the quotes, it stringifies the is teacher part which is here and then for these channels, it stringify the channels and then it stringify the nested object we did. But when we create a circular reference, here we have the hello property and we're referencing the object again. What that means is that when the JSON stringify comes to the hello part, that means it's going to go through this again, stringify this, stringify this, stringify this. Let's put stringify all the previous. And then when it comes to the hello property again, it's going to stringify all the previous. And when it comes to the hello property again, it's going to stringify all the previous. So you can see this is like an endless loop or let's say an endless 
recursion. JSON Stringify doesn't know when it's going to stop stringifying. And that is why when it comes across a cyclic reference, it throws an error. So now if I try to run this again after creating my circular reference here, if I run this, see we have an error. Converting circular structure to JSON. The reason for this error, as you can see, is because JSON Stringify doesn't know when to stop stringifying. It's like an endless loop where it, when it comes across hello, it stringifies. When it comes across hello, it stringifies and it doesn't know when to stop. So when it encounters a circular reference, it immediately throws an error. And this can be called anything. You can also call this self. You can call this myself. You can call this hi. You can call this whatever property. The point here is that that property is a reference to the same object. That is a circular reference in JavaScript. Now you may be asking, why do people create circular references in JavaScript? Generally, circular reference is considered a bad practice, but some people still do it. I'm still making a research myself to understand the use cases for this. So maybe I'll make a separate video once I'm done with my research. But the point of this video is just for you to understand the concept of circular reference. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, share with others, subscribe and also turn on notifications for more concepts in JavaScript that will be simplifying.